Hey guys, what's going on? What's going on? Street Trading here. This is our weekly trade recap from last week, 22nd to the 26th. Well, 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 uh, there were some moves in the market, huh? I, look at, just look at what we're, what we're staring at right here. This is pretty much the whole month of uh, February. This is a big curl to the downside, right? Clearly the 18th or the 16th printed its highs. And now we're seeing the other side of the market, right? The sloppy fighting side of the backside of highs, right? Uh, don't look more into it than what you're seeing. Not talking tops, not talking backside, not talking bear market, not talking none of that shit. Talking about a character change. We talk about this all the time. We're talking about a character change, all right? You see a big difference right here right here on the 16th is the, is the divider right this is where things changed right this is where things changed 17th identical to the 18th identical to the what tw uh, 22nd identical rinse and repeat right they try to push prices up test these uh, highs flush it out guys this is don't think this is just coincidental just randomness because it's not all right it's not look how sloppy this from the 17th is compared to the first to the 16th, 17th. Huge difference. This is fear, right? You see this type of shit. Look at look at the, from the 23rd, 24th, 25th, and 26th. This is straight fear, guys. Sloppy fear. Random, drastic, you know, emotional reactions to the market. And that's what's going on. Period. All right. Plain and simple. That's why we always talk about trade the flow, right? You can always have opinions, of course, of what you think it, the market will be doing or where it's going to be headed. There's nothing wrong with that. But if you're wrong, fucking you're wrong, and then end up trading what the market's giving you, right? Don't fight and don't force your bias on the market. The market's going to hand your ass every single time. So this type of random emotion, huge push to sell off, guys these are guys fighting the inevitable fighting the reality of the direction of the markets all right keep that in mind keep things fucking simple you have your technicals you have your fundamentals easy you're going to learn that if you haven't learned that already learn those skills a monkey can learn those skills then you got to work on yourself your psychology your mindset of how you react to the market be objective right not subjective you understand have a rules based trading system approach that you look at the market every single day if this then that if this happens i will do that not well if this happens then i'll i'll probably do that and, and guys it, when you're trading live it's completely different than when you're trading not live on paper or whatever you guys do right you need to have a if this then that scenario to make money extract it managing managing your emotions keeping those emotions at bay because when you have if this then that scenarios all of this shit becomes you react to it, right? It becomes a flow, being, becomes part of your trading process. The market's pushing higher. You have an if this scenario for a security that you're looking at on your watches for that particular session. If your security does this, then you do that. It's that simple. Have a plan, a crystal clear set of rules, five rules. The stock needs to do one, two, three, four, and five. If it does all those, then I do six. I'll just give an example. One, two, three. If it does the, the three, I do four. If it does not, then you don't do it's. It's not like a, a fucking guess. Well, I'm, I'm gonna do it now because I feel it. It's I feel it's in my gut, right? 